Yannick Sinner, the world's number one ranked men's tennis player, twice tested positive for anabolic steroids that he claims came through massages received from his physiotherapist. I can relate. I once received a speeding ticket after receiving a bad massage that left my right leg too heavy. Yeah, the cop didn't buy it either. But what a sort of bought Sinner's excuse. You see, in Italy, Sinner's homeland, you can buy an ointment without a prescription called Trophodermin that's used to treat skin infections from cuts and abrasions and contains cholesterol, the same anabolic steroid found in Sinner. Sinner claims that his trainer purchased the Trophodermin and then gave it to his physiotherapist who had cut his finger, who apparently applied it to his hands before giving Sinner a massage. Now that may sound fishy, but in 2020, Italian researchers found that a simple handshake with someone who had applied 5 milligrams of a cholesterol containing ointment to their hand could transfer enough cholesterol into the other person to produce a failed drug test. And that's exactly why Trophodermin comes with a clear label saying it contains cholesterol and its use goes against against doping regulations, something Sinner, his trainer, and physiotherapist, all Italians, should have known because 50% of all the positive cholesterol tests occur in Italy. Now, Sinner received a three-month instead of a one-year longer ban, in part because WADA said the amount found in Sinner's system was minute, but athletes have been known to microdose banned substances to avoid detection. However, it is within the realm of possibility that Sinner and his team are more idiots than cheats. Just saying. As always, my answers come from peer-reviewed research.